Well, it appears that Stephen Anderson has apparently changed his policy in regards to the heresy of Calvinism and the heretics who adhere to the heresy of Calvinism in his church. In this clip I'm going to show, he is, you know, just doing a typical Anderson yelling, but he is saying that essentially, correctly saying that Calvinism is a, is a heresy and doctrine of devils, and that, you know, Calvinism is a attack on the gospel of Christ. Now, obviously, the new IFB doesn't preach the gospel. They preach a, a gospel void of repentance. But he is right that Calvinism is a demonic, you know, doctrine of devils, plain and simple. So here's the clip. Then I'm going to show you how he contradicts himself and actually says that Calvinist love is preaching. Check this out. You don't need that poison, that leaven, that false doctrine in our church. Right. And to come unto the knowledge of the truth. Amen. And you know what? These bunch of Calvinists, they make me sick. Amen. I hate their doctrine. Right. I hate their preaching. Amen. It's wicked. It perverts scripture. It perverts the Bible. They are my enemies until the day that I die. Amen. They're the enemies of all righteousness. They're the enemies of the gospel. And I don't care if they call themselves Baptist or a Reformed Baptist. I don't care what they call themselves. They will never have any fellowship with this preacher right here. I want nothing to do with them Amen. until Jesus comes. Amen. Nothing to do with them. They're not accepted here. We don't accept them in our church. If you're, you say, well, I'm a Calvinist, well, then get out and don't come back. Right. We don't need that poison, that leaven, that false doctrine in our church. Hey. Now, he's making very clear, Calvinists are not welcome in the church. They're not welcome. I don't like their doctrine, which is, you know, amen. Calvinism is a, a very evil, false doctrine. It's an attack on the gospel of Christ. But watch this other clip where he actually contradicts himself and comes out and says that Calvinists actually love his preaching. And Calvinists actually walked up to him during the service, which, which would have meant that Calvinists were actually in the church to tell him that. So apparently, I guess he's changed his policy in regards to Calvinism. Check this out. I'm glad that every single meeting that I've preached at for the past six months, listen to me now, somebody has walked up to me at that meeting who was a first-time visitor and said, I'm a Calvinist who loves your preaching, and that's why I'm here. Yeah, just one of the many ways that the new IFB cult leader, Stephen Anderson, has totally contradicted himself. I mean, not the first time, but I guess it now seems like he's changed his policy in regards to the heresy and error, doctrinal error of Calvinism. I've done many videos exposing Calvinism. It's an attack on the gospel. It has very few scripture to back it up. It's, it's simply just they have a select few scriptures, like, you know, maybe 12 or 13 select few verses. And all their scriptural teaching revolves around their eisegesis of these select few verses. It's a typical... It's, your, it's just your typical heresy built on out-of-context scriptures and built on, you know, strongly arguments and built on just canned answers based on these verses taken out of context. So, you know, Calvinism is a false doctrine, but apparently Stephen Anderson has now reversed his position and now is happy that Calvinists like his preaching and is now, you know, because again, in order for the Calvinists to tell him that, it would have to actually, he would have to have to be in the church to walk up and say, hey, I like your preaching, you know, yeah. It's a bunch of garbage, but hey, one of the ways that Pope Stephen Anderson has totally contradicted himself. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye.